How old do you think she might be? 14? 15? 16? Do you have any idea what she might be going through now? Emotionally, psychologically, or even physically? How many of our friends are able to survive such situations? Most importantly, who cares about us and our situations? The World Health Organization defines mental health as the state of mental well-being that enables people to cope with the stresses of life, realize their abilities, learn and work well and contribute to their community. It is estimated that depression and anxiety alone cost the global economy over $1 trillion each year. In low-income and middle-income countries, over 75% of people with mental disorders receive no treatment at all. Our situation here in Ghana is no exception. Only 1% of the health sector budget goes into mental health. It is therefore not surprising that of about 2.3 million people suffering from mental conditions in Ghana, only 2% receive treatment and support. This situation is rather dire for us adolescents. A research report by Samuel Ajalolo in October 2022 indicates that globally 10 to 20 percent of adolescents suffer from depression and anxiety Ghana's adolescent population is of about 6.9 million these are people between the ages of 10 and 19 years research shows that about 7 percent of school pupils in Ghana suffer from depression and anxiety currently our Ghanaian adolescents are exposed to several risk factors this may include poverty physical abuse harsh parenting divorce stressful school environment discrimination low self-esteem we do not want to lose our adolescents to such unfortunate situations. We have to, one, identify adolescents going through such precarious situations. Two, identify the social and structural factors which put adolescents in such situations. And three, apply appropriate interventions, build resilience, and establish social support to save all adolescents. Here at St. Mary's Adolescent Support Center, we have trained and specialist care providers who provide peer support services in the form of peer counseling, social support services, and child protection services. Our services are based in the form of first aid. We refer cases beyond our ability to hospitals and other specialist services. Our aim is to reach out to our peers who may find themselves in one situation or the other and help them come out of their problems. If all adolescents can enjoy a happy life without mental challenges, our nation will be a better place to live in. A mentally healthy adolescent makes a better future for Ghana.